she looks with her dark black hair and her two braids. Family, are we sure this is a drawing? Because it looks so good that it looks like it was made on the computer. Ta-da! The hand is officially done and it is ready to go on top of Wednesday's shoulder. Wow! We just made the world's biggest Wednesday doll ever! Family, today we're looking at the craziest art from Wednesday ever! Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Nugget, I didn't say Friday. I said whoa, 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 Wednesday. Bro, yeah, Friday. I know it's party time. No. Baby Nugget, baby Nugget, no. I'm talking about the new Netflix show Wednesday. And if you don't smart up, I'm gonna turn you into that creepy looking hand it. And then you're gonna look like a chicken nugget version of Choo Choo Charles. Eh? Yeah. Smash like on today's video if you want to see the coolest art ever. Let's get this video to 10,000 likes, family. I know we can do it. Because if we don't, I heard you're going to get haunted underneath your bed tonight when you sleep. And the ghost is going to look like Wednesday. Ah! All right, first we have somebody drawing Wednesday herself with these really cool crayons. Or, or are they markers or paintbrushes? Actually, that kind of looks like chalk I use on my front driveway. Wow! Look how cute Wednesday looks. Or actually, I mean, kind of spooky or kind of mean or... Actually, family, maybe she just got to go potty. <laughs> Anyways. Now look at this drawing. This is even cooler than the first one. This person knows how to draw super duper realistic art. And they are also drawing Wednesday. But instead of making a cartoon version, it's gonna look exactly like the real human in the TV show. Oh man, family. So if you don't know who Wednesday is or if you haven't watched the show, don't worry. Because you're about to see exactly what she looks like. Wow, oh, look at those eyes. They're already giving me a little shivers. Wow, look, they're even doing her face now, too. Uh, but why are they coloring her blue? Her name is supposed to be Wednesday. Not blueberry. That is a fruit. All right, family, so you see here, they're using a bunch of different colors to make her face. We got peach. We got white. We got purple. We got pink. We even got uh, charcoal on the chin. She got a lump of coal for Christmas and started eating it. Because my mommy told me when I got cold that I'm not supposed to do that. And I said, Mom, why did Santa even give me coal in the first place? I'm like the nicest kid ever. I'm always nice to baby nuggie. Oh, oh. Please. And here we have the final product. Look how cool she looks. With her dark black hair and her two braids. Family, are we sure this is a drawing? Because it looks so good that it looks like it was made on the computer. Or maybe someone drew it in Roblox. Family, comment down below Wednesday as the secret word of today's video. And me and Baby Nuggie will heart your comment. Oh, family, if you thought the other art projects were cool, you better wait for this one. Or maybe you should just stick your hand out. Or maybe put it back in. Because if you leave your hand out too much, and somebody might chop it off. Because the next art thing we're about to make is it from Wednesday. And if you don't know what it is, it is a hand. But not a hand with the body. It's just a hand because I think that hand got a choppity chopped off and uh, now it's alive on its own without a human. If you've seen the show, it is the creepy hand that stays on top of Wednesday's shoulder and sometimes moves around. This person is making it here out of aluminum foil. <laughs> what? Family, I use aluminum foil to cook chicken nuggets in my kitchen. Well, actually, I don't do it. My mommy does it for me because she tells me the oven is super duper hot and I should not touch it. But sometimes I also use aluminum foil to wrap my hair because then I feel like an astronaut wearing a space helmet. I'm basically ready to go to space. Okay, so now we covered the aluminum foil with a lot of tape. And then after we wrapped every single finger with all that tape, we're now covering it with this gray clay. Why aren't we covering it with gray clay, family? I don't think that's the color of its hand. And okay, now that the clay is on, we are sculpting the hand to have the different finger lines and all the nail parts and everything. Oh, even these lines right here in your palm. My mommy used to tell me that if somebody special looks at the palm of my hand, hand that they will know all of my deepest darkest secrets uh wait a second family but i don't want people to know my secrets oh here comes the ketchup but um 
<laughs> Why are they painting the hand with ketchup and not red paint? I mean, I'm not gonna tell the artist what to do or anything, but uh... Excuse me, Mr. Artist Man, sir. I think you're wrong. Oh, now we're brushing it with gray. And now we're painting it with white. Look at all the stitches in the hand. Oh, and now we even get to put on some nail polish. And just like that, family, ta-da! The hand is officially done. And it is ready to go on top of Wednesday's shoulder. Or maybe if you ask nice enough, maybe it can go on yours. Smash like if you want that. This person has a bunch of different Rubik's cues that apparently he's using as a chair. Silly Mr. Artist Man, sir, what are you doing? Oh, oh, uh, wait. Now he's taking those Rubik's cubes that he was sitting on and he's putting them against the wall. But he's changing the colors of the Rubik's cubes to be in a specific pattern to draw a picture. And what is that picture, family? Oh, no way, no way. He made a giant picture of Wednesday's face with Rubik's Cubes. This is the most creative art I've ever seen. And also kind of the most spookiest. And that might have been the spookiest art you've ever seen, but family, this is about to be the tastiest. Because look, we just dunked an Oreo cookie in white chocolate. And now we're making a Wednesday cake pop. Or cookie pop. Or Adam's family pop. <laughs> and we even made her body out of a second cut of Oreo. An Oreo version of Wednesday looks better than regular version of Alexia. Because that sure does look like one tasty treat. The lips on the other hand, uh, those just look like a burnt upside down crab that I do not want to get near. All right, family, this next part is going to be a crazy glow of transformation because we are about to transform this giant rainbow high doll into a giant Wednesday doll. Oh, man, this is going to be super duper hard because this doll looks nothing like Wednesday. This doll looks super happy and cute and her hair is all rainbow colors. It's all fun stuff, but, uh... Wednesday is, is, is kind of dark and kind of sad and, and kind of emotionless, you know, like, not like this, like, uh, this. Oh, I don't like myself like that. I like being happy. Goodbye, happy clothing on doll. Goodbye, rainbow hair. Hello, super dark and black dye. Wait, what do they gotta do to dye her hair? I guess I gotta put in this pot of water. Whoa! <laughs> we gotta dunk the doll's head into the dye. Really, that is not gonna work. She's basically just taking a bath in water. That's not gonna make your hair black. There is no way her blue hair will ever, ever, ever turn black. Black! Wow! Look at her hair, family! We dyed it black! She looks kind of good. Next up, we gotta remove her pretty colorful makeup. Oh, man! Now we gotta take off the sparkles, too! That was me and Baby Nugget's favorite part! <laughs> and we even took off her eyebrows, too. I mean, call me a crazy family, but I kind of like her better without them. Before, they kind of look like worms you find on the ground after it rains. Uh, wait a second, Mrs. Artist Simmer, ma'am. I know you gotta take off her makeup, but why you gotta take off the color of her eyes, too? Whoa, family, what is going on? She kind of looks like an alien right now. She has no color to her face, no color to her eyes, and where the chicken nugget did her hair go? I swear to chicken nugget, if we just took all that effort to dye it black, and now they just choppity chop chopped it off, baby nugget is gonna be mad. <laughs> yep, yep, told you. Whoa, look what's happening. We are repainting this doll's face to look exactly like Wednesday. She has dark and gloomy makeup with really dark circles around her eyes. And super creepy black eyeliner. Next step now that her hair and makeup is done is the clothing. Whoa, and now this person is making a complete dress that looks just like Wednesdays. <gasps> oh, my chicken nugget, this looks just like it is in the show. Oh, and some really cute black shoes too. Oh, not just any shoes. Some super high heels. Uh, excuse me, what are we doing here? Uh, why does that p -p -p have a skull and crossbones on it? That doesn't look like a regular water bottle to me. 
But apparently that doesn't matter because we're on to braiding her hair. And now the final transformation. <gasps> wow! We just made the world's biggest Wednesday doll ever. And look what the doll used to look like before. They look completely different. Which one do you like better? All right, family, this person is making a very spooky animated version of Wednesday. And whoa, did you see her family? That's them right there. I see her mommy, her daddy, and uh, is that her brother? Whoa, that's her roommate. Anid. Anid is like the complete opposite of Wednesday. She wears bright colors and happy stuff. But she is a werewolf, so uh, you better watch out for that. I'm just saying. Next up, family, this is gonna blow your mind. This picture is made all with beads and different gems. And some even buttons. And they take those beads and sew them into some kind of picture. And then you get the final result of holy chicken nugget. Oh man, I love this. They made a bead art of Wednesday's face. I mean, I'm not trying to complain, family, but nobody has ever made a bead art of my face. I mean, no one's ever even tried to draw it with jelly beans or nothing. Not even little pieces of cereal or little M&Ms. That's all I wanted for Christmas, but what did my mom give me? A bowl from our kitchen and a couple ice cubes. And she said, have fun in your new pool. And what do we have here? <gasps> I'll dance, dance, dance with my hands, hands, hands above my head, head, head. Wait a second, wait a second. I recognize that song. That's the song that Wednesday dances to. Whoa, those are some cool pictures. Wow, and these are some really cool colorful balloons. <laughs> wait, why is he blowing up all these balloons? What is he doing? What? <laughs> he made a character from Wednesday out of balloons. Family, not only are we seeing really cool art today that people are drawing, we're also seeing some really cool art that people are blowing up with balloons. I feel like I'm at Disney World. This artist makes really cool clothing, and her next piece that she's sewing is... <gasps> A really spooky version of the dress that Wednesday wore in the show. And family, that one might even look better than the one in the real TV show. Wow, that is cool. And if you want to see something else that's super cool, but also kind of weird, but also kind of nice, look at this picture of Wednesday Adams. Oh, and we are about to transform her into a boy. Gotta make the eyeballs smaller, the jawline wider, the cheeks more chiseled. And we're doing something with her nose and her eyebrows, but I'm not sure what. Oh no, they just chopped off her hair and oh, Oh, uh, hello, Mr. Wednesday. Uh, how are you? My name's Alexia. Nice to meet you. And, um, family, snap out of it. Back to the video. I didn't think you was cute or nothing. That, that was you. And family, look at this super duper cool clay art. Because I think they are making the place where Wednesday and her roommate live. Look, there's a really cool window. Kind of looks like a spooky spider web. One side is really colorful and bright. And the other side is Wednesday's side. And uh, that's the spooky one. Wow, look at the finished product. This looks so cool. Look at all the details in the room. We have all of their clothing, their bed and plushies. Um, uh, I don't see their baby nuggy plush though. Maybe they didn't know that he was available on shopalexia.com. Now they'll be able to get him. And look, family, they even have a typewriter and a violin. Wait, is that a violin or a cello? Uh, either way, I'm not gonna say cello. I'm gonna say, uh, goodbye. Because Wednesday makes me feel, uh, scared. Don't forget to get Baby Nuggie and the family hoodie at shopalexia.com. If you like today's video, smash like and smash subscribe. Don't forget to turn on all post notifications so you don't miss any of our videos. Me and Baby Nuggie love you so much. And we'll see you all in the next video.